Goodbye class. Sunday din na lang next subject nyo. In mathematics, a geometric progression, also known as geometric sequence, is a sequence of non-zero numbers where each term after the pairs is found by multiplying the previous one by a fix, non-zero number called the common ratio. Okay, so ngayon, tuturuan namin kayo kung paano mag-solve gamit ang geometric sequence. At ito ang example ng geometric sequence. To solve for the ratio, kailangan nating i-divide ang second term at first term. Second term is 6 and the first term is 3. So, 6 divide 3, it's 2. Kaya 2 ang common ratio ng geometric sequence na ito. Dahil alam na natin ang common ratio, we can easily identify kung ano yung mga susunod na term. 3 times 2, 6. 6 times 2, 12. 12 times 2, 24. 24 times 2, 48. So, ayun yung susunod na term. But what if ang hinahanap na term ay 8 term? Siyempre, hindi natin gumamit ng formula. So, isusulat natin ang formula ng geometric sequence. A sub n, that's the last term, equal A sub 1 times R to n minus 1. The A sub 1 is first term and the R is for ratio. N is the number of term. A sub n equal, the A sub 1 is 3, first term. Time is the common ratio, 2. Followed by the exponent, n minus 1. Ang n natin kung ilan yung terms. Dahil pang 8 ang hinahanap natin, 8 yung ilalagay natin dito. Then, copy minus 1. And next, copy ulit. Sundan lang natin, 3. Time is, uunahin natin isolve ang exponent. 8 minus 1, 7. 2 raised to 7. Dahil 8 minus 1 is 7. Next, copy ulit. 2 raised to 7. Just multiply by 2. So, magiging ganito. So, 2 times 2, 4. 4 times 2, 8. 8 times 2, 16. 16 times 2, 32. 32 times 2, 64. 64 times 2, 128. So, meron tayong 128. Then next, copy, 3 times 128. Pwede natin siyang isolve dito. 3 times 8, 24. 3 times 2, 6 plus 2, 8. 3 times 1, 3. So, meron tayong 384. Nahanap natin na 8 term is 384. Okay, Hanapin mo ang 7 Thank you. 